I'm John Champion, and analysing this game for us is Jim Beckley. Well, thank you. I think this is a brilliant atmosphere awaiting these players today. I can't wait for this one to start. Now, let's see how both these teams will line up. So, Jim Beglin, how do you see this one panning out? Well, John, this could really come down to who finds their rhythm first. <laughs> Off we go, then. The ball played forward, and a strong header. They played it in early, but they couldn't finish it off. Oh, such a great ball to pick him out as well. It deserved a lot better, but it's easy to say it from where I'm sitting. Well, that should... And it's hoofed away, and here's a volley. Oh, that's a vital stop. Oh, he's done ever so well there. That's a wonderful, wonderful save. Plays this forward. Through ball over the top. And he makes absolutely no mistake. It's one goal to nil. Super teamwork there. Well, the run met the pass perfectly, and that's always tough for any defence. They get us underway at 1-0. Oh, they've done well to take the lead there, but they can't let their opponents back in. They have to stay focused. Tries a shot from distance. They're in again. Goal! Now have the all-important equaliser. Well, that's something that will make the manager proud because they dug in deep then and they've got their leveller. Really quick reactions to the loose ball. I know questions will be asked of that defence, but there was an element of good fortune in that. He's looking to play it into the channel. And a header! Oh, he'll be kicking himself for that. And there's the end to the first 45. Yeah, we may have had a couple of goals, but there haven't really been many chances. I can see both managers looking to liven it up in the second half. So, nothing to separate the two teams. It stands at one apiece. Some slick passing on display. What can they make of it? It's come through to him. Can he now find a finish? No, he wasn't decisive enough. Yeah, he just gave the defence too much time to regroup. In the end, he was forced into rushing it. Great chance for the counter. Wax it! He just took too long there. Oh, you've got to make your mind up quicker than that. He just allowed the defence to get back behind.
And he hits it in towards the middle. Tries his luck. That was a real chance. Well, maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead there. in the last 15 minutes of the game. This is very pleasing on the eye. He's unlucky not to score there. Well, look, his odds from that sort of range were never great, and yet he almost produced a very, very good finish. Picked it off. Good support. He decides to shoot. He so nearly exploited that mistake. Oh, he did really well to force the mistake by pressuring them like that. That's great grit for you. Ball in. Direct volley. He can't be too happy with that. Slides it through. Intercepted. And that brings to an end 90 minutes of football. No complaints about the match, but it ends all square. Nothing between them. Well, they both had chances to win it, but there was very little between these teams, so it's really not a surprise they couldn't be separated. My thanks go to Jim, and it's now time for us to leave tonight's coverage. We both wish you a very good evening. up a real cracker. Here are the lineups for today. So much has been written and said in the build-up to this game. But what sort of contest are you really expecting? Well, both teams have spent enough time on preparation. I mean, physically and tactically, they should be in perfect condition. It might come down to look today, you know. And we're now underway. This is lovely passing to watch. No, it was cut out. Maybe now. The first effort of the game. Peters. He's going it alone. It's opened up nicely for him. Claims it right in front of the goal like that. He's gone. Now gone in the first half. He's making a good run here. Possession maintained. Keeper's got a strong hand on the ball.
caught on the edge there, or was it in the box? No, it was outside the box. Well, this just about the ideal distance out. It's true. Now the chance. Just how wasteful was that? Now, he's on the ball. Where's he taking it? And there is the referee's whistle to end the first half. Oh, this has been such a disappointing spectacle. The keepers haven't been worked nearly enough. So, it's nil-nil. Let's hope for a goal. Can he now find a finish? That would have been some goal. Their first substitution of the match. Yeah, still no goals in this second half, and this substitution is the first sign that the managers aren't happy to let it stay this way. Header! A good ball in, but he couldn't finish it off. That was such a good effort, despite the attention of his marker. I thought he did really well there. Feeds a long ball into space. He's onside here. Drives it in. Oh, he wasn't taking any chances there. Well, he's won it, and he's cleared it, and that is no nonsense. To... He has a go. Good strike, but straight at the keeper. Intercepts the pass. Pumps it forward. And there is the final whistle. The only people happy with a goalless draw will be the coaches. Strange people, they hate dirty washing, they love clean sheets. Many thanks to Jim alongside me, and that is finally it for the broadcast this afternoon. Summarizer, Jim Beckman. So, Jim, nearly time to kick off. How do you see this one going? Well, I'm sure the two sets of players will respond to our expectations, but the key point today may well be taking those chances. And the lineup score today. Away we go, then. Toivonen. Here it is. There's a possibility here for a shot. Toivonen. He makes his way towards the penalty area.
The whistle signals the end of the first half. Well, this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers. Nothing has been created for them. I think the service has been extremely poor. So, it's nil-nil. Let's hope for a goal or two in the second half. Plays this forward. Looking to carve open the defence. Now he's ready for a shot. That was a super ball in. Did it? The effort was good, but that not quite good enough. The flag stays down, and he crosses it into the middle. They're just missing that finishing touch. Well, it just goes to show you how effective a counter-attack can be, because when you move the ball at pace like that, it only takes seconds to create a threat. Now he crosses into the centre. The cross cleared away, driven in. But they have because there's no way to score from there. The ball is sent into the middle. A header! He tries to slide it past the defence. It's true. Cut out in a promising position. Yep, referee's gone to his pocket, it's a yellow for a fairly careless challenge he didn't really have to make. Could have been another colour too, certainly some sections of the crowd think red would have been more appropriate. So, extra time now beckons as the referee blows his whistle, and what a treat for all of us. Well, despite the scoreline, this one hasn't felt like a nil-nil to me. It's really ebbed and flowed and thoroughly enjoyable. Extra time underway. The managers have had five minutes or so each to get their messages across to the respective groups of players. Not able to say much, but it's a vitally important time. A chance. Shoots here. A decent chance wasted. Well, he really should have opened the scoring there. Still a very tense game. This is lovely passing to watch. Oh, not a good tackle at all. Free kick given. And that was a late challenge that brings a yellow. And he goes direct. He went for power there. Well, technically, that was a beautifully struck shot from so far out. And I just thought he was a little unlucky then. Counter attack. It's come through to him. And a shot here. The post in the. Possibilities here. Oh, he has scored! At last, we've got the goal we were waiting for. All goals are welcome, but when they come at a time like that, they're priceless. He was allowed far too much space. I think you can put that goal down to an economy of movement. Why not loiter closer to goal? Just let the ball do the work for you. They get us underway at 1-0. Half-time arrives in extra time with one side narrowly in front. No managers on the pitch at this stage. They'd love to come on and give some pearls of wisdom. They're not allowed to. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. He's latched onto it, back off the post. Surely this time, very close, but just past that right-hand post. 
and that was more than a decent attempt. Perhaps it deserved better too. It's come through to him. They've done it. Surely it's game over now. He escaped the shackles and finished very well. Yeah, defensively they thought they had him where they wanted him, but he's forever on his toes and he showed terrific movement to manufacture some space and score. A brace of goals for him now. There's the whistle, signalling the end of extra time. They'll definitely be disappointed to miss out on a quarter-final spot. The players, though, look proud, don't they? And why shouldn't they be getting this far? Many thanks to Jim alongside me. That is finally it for the broadcast this afternoon.